Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, IE Fashion. Today I'm coming to do a review on this strapless, backless, strapless, backless, strapless, backless, frontless bra, you guys. It sounds crazy, but we're gonna get into it. So as you guys can tell, your girl is, she's sitting, honey. She is sitting, look at these. Like, who's my doctor? You wanna know who my doctor is? You wanna know who my doctor is? You wanna know? Yeah. No, I have on a strapless, backless, frontless bra, you guys. I came across this bra on Instagram from the company called Mrs. Kisses. I'm gonna leave their information right here. And um, yeah, you guys, I was so interested in seeing this bra because I was never able to do styles like this. I was just curious on how this bra would work and if I would be able to use it and if it does what it says. And so I went ahead and purchased this bra, you guys. You guys, the crazy thing about this bra is it goes from like a B to like a triple H or a Z or whatever the number is. I'll put it across the screen. But this bra is intentional. The bra comes in three styles. The shallow, which is just a slight dip. The moderate, which is the one that I have for a four inch plunging neckline. And then the deep, which is a six inch plunging neckline that goes all the way to your belly button. It also comes with this travel size bag, an optional strap, as well as some anti-slip silicone stickers. Purchase the bra on Black Friday weekend. And so I know it was kind of gonna be kind of crazy as far as getting my bra back and getting a response and things like that. The customer service was A1, you guys. Um, they don't know I'm doing this review. They don't know that I have a YouTube channel. So they don't know that you guys are gonna get the tea on this bra. The customer service was A1. Um, off the top, I got a response. As Soon as I made my order, I got like a confirmation, an email. And then maybe like four day, four to five days later, I got a tracking number and then the item was um, sent within two days from that tracking number. So I got my item within a week during Black Friday, like that whole fiasco. So that's kudos to them for that. Now you guys, the bra does exactly what it says. It is strapless, it is backless, it is um, frontless where it's no bra on the front as you guys can see. This is what the bra looks like. This is the right side, the right side with the logo on it. And this is the left side. And you would put it on like so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it will hold like that. These are the volumizing um, pads which you stick on and they are labeled right side if you guys can see that. As well as the left side. And they don't have a particular way as far as if, how to put them on. You can just slip them on like this and have them like that. Or you can turn them and want them like that. You can do that as well. It comes with four stickies to stick your pads on. You take off the sticky side with the logo first. And you can place that on the inside of your bra. And they said that if it hangs over, it's okay. Stick that on just like so, and then you're gonna take off this envelope and stick your pad on. So, this is actually sticky, and it's like grip, it's not sticky, it's more so like a grip so that your pads doesn't slide. So, now this is not moving, it's gripped on. You're gonna do the same thing to the other side. It's not sticky. And so those are on. And now you're gonna take the same method where you put on the actual pad. And then you're gonna take And I forgot to mention this detachable strap that it also comes with to make sure your bar is laying flat. The, can we, you guys wanna start with the negatives? You want me to get into it? Let's, let's jump right into it then. The negatives, the cost of the bra. 
Y'all, this bra is over $100. Your girl has never paid over $100 for a bra. Now, I spent $100 on makeup. I spent $100 on bundles. But I don't spend $100 on a bra. I, I just don't. I get a little bra from Burlington's, Ross, DDs, any type of little department store, Walmart. It doesn't matter. It's a bra, okay? It's a bra. No, I have not ever, I have never spent $100 on a bra. This bra was over $100. I had a 30% off coupon, so I paid roughly $80 to $90, I think, um, with shipping and taxes and all that good jazz. So yeah, the con is the cost. Don't nobody got $90 to be spending. Nonetheless, the bra does exactly what it says, you guys. Another negative I would say is the bra is not easy to put on at all. When you first get your bra um, and you get it out of the box, you have to adjust it to and mold it and shape it to lay and adhere to your breast the way it's supposed to, the way it's designed. When the bra comes, you have to bend them, bend, the, bend it and shape it and make sure it sits the way it is. Once it's adjusted, then you're gonna get the effect. But I ain't gonna lie, you guys, it took me an hour or two to fix my bra to the point where I was like, you know what, I'm gonna send, this, I'm gonna send it back because this bra is not working. I had to do a video consultation with one of the workers there, which they offer free consultation via Skype or FaceTime. And literally the representative, the lady who works there, she got on the FaceTime. I was like, hey girl. She was like, hey girl. And we literally went through the motions of installing the bra together. And she showed me how to install it. And she basically put hers on for me, um, for me to see her putting it on. And then I put mine on and she showed me what I was doing wrong. She showed me what I should do. And now I have it the way I needed it. So now that it's adjusted, the positive is I don't have to readjust it because my boobs aren't changing size. They're not changing, they're, you know, they're, they're there. So this is good, but that's a positive. But the negative is trying to put on the bra. That is a definitely a negative because usually you just strap on the bra and go, but no, this required work. So um, a lot of people wanted to know about this wire. So I'm gonna get up close so you guys can see. It is a wire with this bra. Uh, and my wire is deep down in there. That's the wire. And everybody's like, does the wire hurt? It looks painful. Does the wire hurt? It looks painful. I don't know, that wire, that metal wire in your stomach. Can I sit down? Can I dance? Can I move around? Is it gonna fall? Is it? No, 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 it is not, you guys. The wire is not painful. You don't even think about the wire being there. It's kind of like your own bra. You know how you have wiring there? You don't think about it unless that is stabbing you. You're not thinking about it. And you're not thinking about this because it's not stabbing you. It's literally laying against your skin. It's not digging in your skin. It's not poking your skin. It's not wedging in your skin. I'm sitting down in this video and I ain't paying it no mind. I'm telling you, it's, it's definitely just sitting there. It's not when I take it off. And I wore this yesterday, you guys, from what time was my photo shoot? Cause I wore it during my um, engagement photo shoot and I had on a strapless dress and I wore it starting like around three and we got home like around nine. So I wore it for a good little bit of time, you guys. And I was walking, I was moving, I was bending over, I was sitting for the photo shoot. And I didn't even recognize, realize that it was the wire there. Like, and you know what's so good, you guys? You know what I liked about this wire? During my photo shoot, you know how you need to suck it in, hold it in, make sure you're slim and cute? I didn't have to. I remember that bar was there and it was pushing me in. But yeah, you guys, it was, it's, it's really, it's, it looks, and I get it because I was thinking the same thing, but I'm telling you, trust your girl. This wire does not bother you at all. This bar is just literally a bar just there. It's not digging, it's not bending into your skin. It's just there. And if for any reason your bar or your wire is hurting you, you should you may not have your bra on right. So um, somebody asked about nipple piercings with your bra. And I just got, got up some questions from their Instagram that I had seen a lot of people were curious about. It has nothing to do with your nipple piercing because the bra is on the side of your boob and your nipple piercings should be on the front of your boob. 
But yeah, the bra is sitting right here, you guys. This is the bra, and this is the wire, and this is your nipple piercing. So it has nothing to do with nipple piercings. Um, it's not painful. Um, the pads, the pads that comes with the bra, those are very necessary to wear them. Um, they also have grip, little clear grip. Um, I have mine on already, so they come in like this, but these are like slip resistant pads. They're not sticky. They're, they're like that grip feeling where you can't, I can't explain it. It's not sticky at all, but it's just like literally a silicone gel that's like grip resistant. So it's not, your bra's not sliding off. And it does that, you guys. I also saw on their website that if for any reason yours doesn't feel like it's doing that anymore, you can run water on them and clean them off and then put them back on and it'll go back to normal. Because they're not sticky, it's not like causing stickiness and messiness on your boobs, so that's a good thing. Um, that's basically it, you guys, with this bra. I enjoy it. Yes, you can dance. Yes, you can move. Yes, you can sit down. Um, it does exactly what it said it was going to do. I know the cost isn't the prettiest amount and also it is pretty hard to put on but once you do that video consultation and they walk you through putting it on or you watch their video, they have a video on their Instagram, they have a video on YouTube, they have a video on their website. You are good to go, you guys. I ain't gonna lie, it took me some time but I got it and your girl is in there, honey. She's in there. She's in there. See, but the bra hasn't went anywhere, you guys. The bra is still on. So, I'm going to show you guys the difference from the two. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below if you have any other questions that I did not touch or address. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Peace.